All right. It's been a long time coming. John Wilkes Booth. Overshadowed by my father, I wanted the South to be a world superpower because I was living in DC, supporting the Confederacy. The South wanted to see that and succeed in my assassination plot with my buddy George. That's all right, man. We're gonna be a pop because after Max Jones, he was lacking. Rode away in a horse, parents straight laughed, and Secretary Souter had a carriage incident. He was in a neck break. There's a family in the suburbs. There was only one man for the job. Looks like I'm gonna make quick work of him. That's gonna be the last word from him. I gotta make a name for myself. Ain't no one gonna remember some 19th century actor, but they'll sure remember a presidential assassination contractor. Two shots of Brandon, and I'm walking up the hallway to the president. Well, that's where I was sitting in the bar waiting for the vice president. Powell pulled up the second to your house, posing his doctor. Powell failed the assassination program before he even got to the bed. That's why I jumped him and floating over through the plan. That just left one man. Me. John Wilkes Booth, you see. I used my Derringer one shot in the back of the head. Damn, Abe was dead. Rathbo tried to stop me. He got a knife in the arm. I intentionally did the ladies no harm. Six Summer Tide ran to the south of the Venge. Now I'm on the run with a gun. Wonder if I'll still see the sun because I got the whole union looking for me, you see. I'm trying to reinvigorate the southern cause with a clause. And now that the president's dead, there's enough said. We chopped off the head of the union. And now it's time for the Confederate leaders to have a reunion.